In the uh, previous video, I explained that a prime number is a number that can only be divided by 1 and itself. So, for example, if you look at 7, the only way to, to break this 7 down is to, to do it as 7 times a 1. Um, if, if you look at the 6 here, 6, you, you can write 6 as a 3 times a 2. You see, because, because, um, because 7, the only way to, um, to, to break up the 7 is to use 1 and itself. So, so this here is a prime number, a 7 is a prime number, whereas a 6 here, we, we, we don't have to just use a, a 6 and a 1. We can use, we found an example where, where you don't have to use 6 and a 1, so therefore this is not a prime. Well anyway, in this video, we, we're going to find out all the primes between, um, between 1 and 100. Okay, so, um, well, the, the, the first one, uh, let's just say 0 is not a prime. Okay, zero is not a prime. Okay, the first one would be uh, would be two. So this one here, two is a prime. Now, if if two is a prime, then four cannot be a prime because because you can write four as um, uh, as uh, two times a two. So so four is not a prime. Now six here, well six you you can also write six as a three times a two. So because two is already a prime, as uh, well, six divided by two is is a is a whole. It will give you a whole number. So six is not a um, a uh, a prime. Well, eight here. Eight. You you can visualize eight as eight equals um, uh, four times a two. So so um, well, you could say eight divided by uh, by a whole number, and it will give you a whole number. Uh, there there exists a whole number where where you can get. Well, you get, if you get 8 divided by this whole number here, which let's say 4, then it gives you another whole number. So, so 8 here is not a prime. Okay. Um, well, it, it turns out that all, all the even numbers, you, you can write it as, um, as a 2 times blah, 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 blah. So all the even numbers are, are not prime apart from the, 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 the 2 here. So, so for example, you, you can see that 12 Twelve can be written as um, as a six times a two, so twelve is not a uh, a a, uh, a prime. Well, twenty two can be seen as eleven times two, um, and and all these here, forty two. You can you can visualize forty two as um, twenty one times uh, times two. So f well, all, all the even ones uh, would disappear because you you can always write a. a uh, you can always write as two times something. So, um, so because because R two is already a prime, we, we we can get rid of all the even all the even numbers. Okay, because all the even numbers you you can just get it and divide it by two. So that would give you another whole number. Okay, so let's let's get rid of all the even numbers here. Now, um, so uh, yeah, just bear with me on this one. Uh, it, it might take a while. So so get rid of all, all the even numbers here. Uh, so this this might take a while. You you, you can do this yourself as well. Um, so bear with me. Get rid of all the even numbers here, and eventually, ha <laughs> ha. Um, Eventually, we, uh, we we will get to a list of all all the primes between between one and one hundred. So so all these goes. Hang on. Yeah. Okay. So the next the next prime would be uh, three. Now, if three is a prime, well, there one, two, three. That's already gone. Uh, because uh, six six you can visualize as three times two. So. One, two, three here. Um, uh, nine, you, you can visualize uh, nine as nine equals three times three. So, so nine is not a, uh, a, a prime. So that can, that can go. So one, uh, two, three, twelve. Well, twelve, you, you, it's already gone, but you can visualize twelve as four times three. Okay. So luckily twelve is already gone. So one, two, three. Let's look at the fifteen. Um, fifteen. Uh, fifteen. You can visualize the fifteen as uh, fifteen equals five times three. See, because because uh, well, basically, because three three is a prime. Every step of three is going to be divisible by three. 
Wait there. One, uh, one, two, three. That's already gone. One, two, three. Well, 21. 21 is divisible by 3 because 21 equals 7 times 3. So that can go 1, 2, 3. That's gone. 1, 2, 3. Well, 27 is divisible by 3. So that, that can go because um, 3 times 9 is 27. So, so, well, anyway, 1, 2, 3, 1, 2, 3. 33. Well, um, 33, 11 times 3 is 33, so that can go, that's not a prime. 1, 2, 3, uh, 1, 2, 3, 39, that can go. 1, 2, 3, uh, 1, 2, 3, 45, that, that, that divides 3. 1, 2, 3, 1, 2, 3, 51 divides 3. 1, 2, 3, 1, 2, 3, 57 divides 3. 1, 2, 3, 1, 2, 3. 63 can divide by 3. Hang on. Let me scroll this. 6. Uh, so it's 1, 2, 3. Uh, 1, 2, 3. Uh, 69 you can divide up by 3. 1, 2, 3. 1, 2, 3. 71 divides 3. 1, 2, 3. 1, 2, 3. 1, 2, 3. 75 you can divide up by 3. 1, 2, 3. 1, 2, 3. 81 you can divide up by 3. 1, 2, 3. 1, 2, 3. 87, you can divide up by 3. 1, 2, 3. 1, 2, 3. 93, you can divide up by 3. 1, 2, 3. 1, 2, 3. 99, you can divide up by 3. Now let's go back to, um, to, to the start here. So, so, so far, we've, we've got 2, so far, 2's a prime and 3's a prime. So the next prime would be 5. Okay, so five is a prime because you cannot think of an, you cannot break up this five as, um, as one thing times another other than, other than itself and one. Okay, so, so this is the only way of breaking up the number five uh, is by itself and one. So five is a prime. Okay, one, two, three, four, five. That's already gone. One, two, three, four, five. Fifteen is already gone. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. 20 has already gone. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Oh, wait there. All the, all the 35s here, that can go. Um, uh, 55 here, that can go. 65, that can go. Um, 85, that can go. 95, that can go. Okay. Well, all the 10s, 20s, 30s, they can go, but they've, they've already gone. So, okay. Uh, seven now. So seven's our next prime. Oh, hang on. Seven here is the next prime. Can you break up the seven other than other than itself and one? No, you can't. So seven, the only way to break up the seven is to well to visualize it as seven times one. There's no other way. So seven's a prime. Okay. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. One, two, three, four, five, six. Seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, 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 seven. You see, forty-nine here divides. Uh, what? Well, well uh, seven times seven is forty-nine. So you know that that's not a prime. Okay. So hang on. Let me just scroll down. Okay, so now it's one, uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. 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 Now seven, seventy-seven. Um, well, se seventy-seven. Well, seven times eleven is seventy-seven. So this is not a prime. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Ninety-one. You, you can divide up by seven. Uh, I don't know what, but you, you can. Okay. Um, you can get a calculator and check it out. That that was ninety-one. Ninety-one. You can divide it by seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. No, no others. So, so seven's a prime. Um, now the next one on the list would be eleven. You see, there's, 
there's no the, 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 you can't break up the eleven. The only way to break up in uh, eleven is is by visualizing as eleven, which is itself, and one. So so eleven's a prime. Okay. Uh, so hang on. Eleven. So it's, uh, one. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Well, actually, it's going to be the all the diagonals one because up here will be ten, eleven. Okay, hang on, let, let me scroll down. So we we were here. Now, if you uh, ten, eleven would be here. Well, it's basically the, the diagonal 10, 11, 10, 11, 10, 11, 10, 11. 10, 11. So we, we've covered up all the 11s now. So 13. Uh, so 13 would be your next next prime. Okay. Um, again, the only way to break up 13 is 13 times uh, a 1, which is itself and 1. So it is a prime. So now it's... Um, now count every uh, every uh, every uh, thirteen. So it will be one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Notice that ten is directly below thirteen. So one, two, three. So that goes. Uh, move down here. That would be ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. Move down here. Ten. Oh, hang on. Let's 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 uh, let's scroll down here. So this this is uh, one here. 10 and then 1, 2, 3. 10, 1, 2, 3. 10, 1, 2, 3. 10, 1, 2, 3. Uh, no, no, well, there, there's no other 13s. So 13 is, um, is the next prime. Uh, and, uh, now 17. 17 would be, well, the only way to break up 17 is 17 times itself, uh, times 1. So, so 17 is a, uh, a, uh, a, a prime. So now it's, um, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 8, 17 here. That's already gone. So 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17. That's already gone. 10, uh, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17. That's already gone. Hang on. So, 10, so we were here. 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17. That's already gone. 10, 1, 2, well, it's, uh, yeah, so, so every 17 steps, we, we, we haven't met any, anything else. Now, um, now, so, so 19 is our next prime. Okay, so, uh, um, so 10, uh, 10, 11, well, 10, 20 will be here. Well, if you, if you, if you, if you start 10, you count 10, uh, it would take you to here. Okay, 20 will take you to here. Let's go back one. That would be 19 here. Okay, now, instead of counting, um, instead of counting 17, sorry, 19 steps, just jump to 10 here. 20, uh, 20 here, go back one. So 19 would be here. Hang on. Uh, and then, and then here, um, uh, and then jump to 10, 20 here. So 19's here. 10, 20, 19's here. So there's no other 19. So 19 is, um, is, uh, is a, a prime. Now, your next prime is 23. Okay, I, 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 I would do this the long way now. Um, uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Um, and then count another ten. So that would be twenty. One, two, three. Okay. Ten. Uh, twenty. Hang on. Twenty. And then one, two, three here. So it's already gone. Ten. Twenty. One, two, three. That's gone. So, so twenty-three is our next prime. The next one is, uh, is twenty-seven. Uh, sorry, 29. So, um, so continue counting it and, and, and see if you meet any other ones. So, so here, 29, uh, so 10, 20, 30, go back one. So that's gone. 10, 
20, 30, go back one, that's gone. So 29 has been covered. Um, so the next one is 30, uh, 31. Okay, so count that. 31, uh, 10, 20, 30. 31 would be here, but it's already gone. Okay, uh, 10, 20, 30. 31 would be here, but it's already gone. So 31 is, uh, uh, is the next prime. 37 here would be your next prime. So, so, Hang on. So I'm going to go to 40 and then minus three steps. So one, uh, 10, 20, 30, 40 minus one, two, three steps. So 37 will be here. Um, well, that's, that's, that's going to cover everything. So the next one will be 40, uh, 40, uh, 41. Okay. So count the next 41 steps. Well, 10, 20, 30, 40. 41 would be here. So, so that, so we've covered everything. Now is, uh, the next prime would be 43. Okay. So, so here, uh, 1, 2, 3, 4. 1, 2, 3. That, that's gone. So, so 43 is a prime. Uh, this one here. Now count, count 49 steps. So, well, I'm going to count, uh, I'm going to count as 50 and then minus 3 steps. So, 10, 20, uh, third, hand, that, that, that was a, uh, that was a seven, I think. Hand. So, so we were here. So, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50. One, two, three steps back. So here. So 49 will be your next prime. And then, uh, 53. Now take 53 every 53 steps. So, uh, one, two, three. Well, 53 is a prime. Uh, this one here is a prime. Uh, uh, and then six, 61, hang on, 53. Yeah, well, I, I think all these are, are, are primes now. Um, all, all these are primes. Be because if you, if you count, well, all, all these will be primes. So, um, yeah, so there, all, all your prime numbers are here. So, so you can scroll here. And, well, anyway, oh, they're, they're all prime numbers.